praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. We thank God for this morning. We thank God for your life. We thank God um, for what the Lord is doing in your life. Uh, once again, today is day number 17 for our journey through Lent, our morning devotion as we are going through the Lent 2023. We thank God that you have joined. We thank God that you are following. We thank God that you are partaking in, in the act of um, fasting and prayer. We believe that at the end of the day, you have a testimony. If you truly, if you truly obey what the Lord is telling all of us. To, to th this morning, once again, we have a theme um, titled Humility and Service. Humility and Service. Our scripture is from Philippians 2, 3 to 4. Philippians chapter 2, 3 to 4. Do not do nothing out of selfish ambition or vain conceit. Rather, in humility, value others above yourself, not looking to your own interest, but each of you to the interest of others, but each of you to the interest of others. As you go through the Lent season, God is um, asking you to, be, to look for the interest of others, not for your own interest, for the interest of others. Even, you might even decide today not to pray for yourself, but pray for others. You might even decide to pray for a friend or a, a family member. You might decide to, to let go of your prayer requests for this day and pray for others. So we must, we must look for the interest of others. You must look for the interest of others. Now the, the scripture tells us as Jesus was an example, he humbled himself. He, he, he humbled himself. He became a servant and self. He is an example for all of us. So God wants us also to humble ourselves and serve others. Remember that we must be an example for others to follow and in humility and serve with love. You must serve with love. You must serve others with love. Humble yourself in everything that you do. Even though at times you want to, you want to serve, but you serve in pride. But the scripture is saying, when you are serving, you must serve in love. You must serve whilst you humble yourself. And as you go through the day, we want to encourage you, reflect on this. How can I demonstrate humility and serve others through, through, during this Lent season? How can I demonstrate humility? You know, as you serve in others, you must humble yourself. You must humble yourself. How can you do that? Reflect on this. And our prayer for you, or if you want to join us, you can pray this prayer. Lord, help me to cultivate humility and serve others with love and compassion. Show me how to follow your example. Like I said, Jesus has set an example for us. He became a servant. How much more us? We need to serve, and God wants us to serve others. God wants us to put others, others' desires in front of us. God wants us to, to pray for others, intercede for others. You know, as you listen to the scripture, it said in verse, uh, 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 Philippians 4, 3 um, to 4, it said, Do not or do nothing out of selfish ambition. Do nothing. Don't do it because you want others to see don't do it because you want your name to be mentioned. Don't do it because others are doing it and you want to do it. But in humility, serve others and God will bless you. May God bless you as you go through the day. Today's devotion is humility and service. Let us humble ourselves. Let us serve and God will reward us. My prayer is that God will help you and God will humble you in every area of your life, every service that God has called you that you will serve in humility. May God bless us. May God keep us. May God keep us until we meet again. In the name of God, the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. This is Journey Through Lent. God bless you for joining. Same time tomorrow morning will come your way. Stay blessed and remain blessed. Live a life of humility. Amen.